today I'm going to walk through setting up my stream timer on Mac for OBS or slobs. This is an application that lets you do countdown and count up timers really easily. So let's get into it. Here I've launched the application and you want to start or stop the stream timer at least once. Then hit copy and this will create a copy into your clipboard of the directory. Open just the file prompt and do command shift G and that will open the go to folder. It's a little bit tricky because Mac is a little bit tricky that way. But here you'll see that I have the files generated, they're text files. And if they're not there, make sure you start and stop the timer and it'll be created. Now go into OBS or slobs and add a new text source. So here we go, a little free text. We'll go ahead and create it. And again, the command is command shift G to open that directory. Now you wanna check that checkbox, read from file. That's very important because that's how it's gonna update. So read from file and then hit browse. Again, command plus shift plus G. We'll go ahead and open that dialog prompt. Now, if you've already navigated to it, it'll be there. Else just go ahead and type it in. Then hit go. Now you'll see all of the different files and I want countdown.txt. And then it'll just show up right there. Now, as I start, it'll automatically count down um, every single second, updating in real time in the application. Now what's really cool is that you can add more minutes, you can stop, you can reset the timer, and you can also set the finish output. But there's also tons of commands that you can put into Stream Deck. You can click on any of these and it'll copy it to count down, start a different you know, timer to the top of the hour. You wanna do open a URL or open a website in Stream Deck. Here I'm just gonna simulate it via the browser. And here it'll say open it and start a countdown to 15 minutes. And here we go, we see it's counting down to 15 minutes. And there you have it, that's setup of my stream timer on macOS.